Hey everybody, um, it's uh, hatching season here at XJC, uh, we've actually just hatched out a few leopard gecko uh, hatchlings, so I just wanted to go through and show some of them to you, I know I haven't really uploaded any videos uh, in a while, but I've just been, just been real busy, um, but uh, there's going to be a ton of more videos to come, I promise I'll try to make some room for uh, for more videos, I've got a lot of stuff uh, coming out and uh, stuff that hasn't hatched yet, and you know a lot of the ball python stuff. So all that stuff, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to get into video format. But um, uh, for those of you who are on my Facebook page, uh, you guys already know. You guys get more updates than uh, all of my YouTube fans who uh, watch my videos. Um, so if your YouTube fan, please be a fan of my page. I update, I update that so much more regularly uh, than I update the YouTube. Um, either way, without further ado, uh, I've had three clutches hatch for me so far uh, from my Leo projects going on. Uh, I got a lot more stuff in the incubator um, that should be hatching out within the next few weeks. But I just wanted to give you guys a little glimpse of what's already out, um, what I'm working with right now, so here you go. Uh, this first clutch uh, was actually from uh, my Maxno Tremper to my Blizzard. I ended up finding out that uh, both of my adults, uh, my Maxno and my Blizzard, uh, all have the patternless gene and obviously the maxon has a tremper gene but the blizzard also has the tremper gene um so i this was more of a mystery clutch for me i wasn't expecting what i got in this clutch because i wasn't aware of the hats that they were for um both of these were bought at a pet store so this was more of a test breeding uh the max snow tremper was also was uh bought at a petco and the blizzard was bought at pet land a few years ago um i've had these for a while um, and just decided to give them a shot at breeding. Uh, so this is what I got. Uh, I got right there a Max Snow Tremper. She's hep for patternless. These were all temp sex female. Um, I just prefer the temp sex female. Uh, my incubator right now says it's temp sex mixed. Um, so the next ones are all going to be random. But these should all be female. Uh, and I got a patternless here who should also be Head Blizzard and Head Tremper. Uh, these two came out from the same clutch again, uh, and have <clears throat> I have probably about another. So far, I have another four eggs in the incubator from the same pairing, and a lot more to come. Again, uh, they just started uh, dropping a few weeks ago, so I've got a lot more to come. Uh, but those are those two. Uh, these hatched out. Uh, three days ago, so these these guys are three. These girls are three days old, and uh, they have a hide. I just took it out for the video, as I did with all the other ones that you'll see coming soon. Uh, this is their hide. So that's them. Uh, next up wasn't anything too crazy. Uh, this was just my hypo. Uh, to the blizzard father again so these are just triple hats uh, these are going to be het patternless, het blizzard, and het tremper um, again nothing too crazy uh, uh, hypo to blizzard het so that's them some of these will be up for sale I haven't decided what I'm keeping yet um, but when I do, they'll be up on my Facebook page in an available album. So anybody who's interested, you know, hit me up on Facebook. I mean, you could comment here too. Uh, but Facebook will have more details as to what everything is and price range. Um, so it's just a lot easier. If I can't get back to you right away, you've already got most of the information there. Uh, this was a super hypo. That was... Uh, the daughter to my blizzard, so she should also be a triple hat super hypo. And um, 
she proved out to pretty much be that. So, um, because of the fact that this morning I had this little girl come out, uh, another patternless, which should be a, a double hat for Tremper and pa and um, Blizzard. So that's that girl, and then I also got another uh, another triple hat, which should be patternless Tremper Blizzard also. Um, so. As of right now, that's all that's hatched out. I have another one of my Blizzard's daughters, which was just a, a straight triple hat um, to him. So I'm waiting for those eggs to come out. Those should hatch out within the next week or so. Um, the updates for that will be on my Facebook page, but I'll try to get a video up if I can on YouTube if I have the time. Um, and then in about another two, two and a half weeks, I should have the second clutches of all the females uh, late, uh, hatch out again, so then I'll see what else I got in those other clutches. Uh, there's a few things I could get. I mean, obviously the best thing uh, for me to get in one of my clutches would be a Max Snow Blazing Blizzard. Uh, Blazing Blizzard's on the other ones. Um, and then I still have Ball Python stuff that has to lay. And I'll probably have a couple videos up on my rack. I mean, I show it to you guys right here uh, it's a rack I built myself it's got all my Leos in it I still gotta build my snake rack um, um, but again uh, I'm gonna have tons of videos I'm gonna have uh, a lot more uh, ball pythons coming in uh, within the next few weeks so all of that will be again updated on here and my Facebook page but more likely my Facebook page than YouTube, or at least more often on my Facebook page. So again, please add my Facebook page, uh, facebook.com slash xjconstrictors, uh, and you guys will have all those updates there for you. So uh, thanks for looking.